years ago, we were fortunate enough to be chosen by Hot Wheels to build a Corvette for them. Woo! It's been a year or two since I've seen this. If they liked it, they would make it into a uh, Hot Wheel. Glad you got by. Sure enough, they made it into an actual Hot Wheel. I'm in the business of building and selling cars, not uh, keeping them. So I took this one to Barrett Jackson, and a guy on the internet bought it. Mike. Hey, Mike. Nice to meet you. Who's the young lady? Is that your girlfriend? Yeah, that's my daughter. I'm Glenn. We're from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. And this is my daughter, Courtney. Right on, dude. This thing looks rad. He's got a few offices around the nation, and he's had the Corvette uh, just down the street in Fort Worth. Looks brand new, man. Have you even driven it? I put about 25 miles on it. Come on, man. If this was my car, I'd have like a thousands of miles on it. I've already been on my third set of tires. A few weeks ago, I decided to see if he might want to sell it because I have the hypo hauler that we also built for Hot Wheels. Now, this is something I was hoping to keep also. You remember, we built the hypo hauler to try to get into the Hot Wheels Redline Club, and they liked it so much that it's actually going to be a Hot Wheel. What do you think about this, Miss Courtney? Oh, well, this is my favorite car in his collection. Oh, really? The paint. So there's amazing. no way I'm going to get it bought back, I guess, huh? <laughs> now, my thought process for wanting to keep them together is, that, you know, they're both built right here at Gas Monkey. They're both Hot Wheel cars. Who knows if I'll ever get a chance to build another Hot Wheel car, but they just need to be together. Can you take me for a ride? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. I'd love to drive, but it's not mine anymore. Wait a minute. I'm not leaving my daughter behind with these guys. No touching. Be Texas gentlemen. drives and performs just like it did when it left Gas Monkey. For me, that's a testament to the quality and craftsmanship of what we do here at Gas Monkey. To him, he really should drive it more. I think he was really happy to be back in that car, reacquainted again. <laughs> you know, now that I've been out on the street in the Midas Monkey,